How do you make a tissue dance? Put a little boogie in it. All jokes aside, our students come to school and are constantly exposed to each other's germs. In fact, the average child has 6 to 10 colds a year. Luckily, here at Belvedere School District, hygiene is a top priority this flu season. The Victory Electrostatic Sprayer spreads a mist across all surfaces, and within 30 seconds, the day's germs disappear. We own three sprayers and we sanitize our classrooms, bathrooms, and weight room every night. The Odorox air purifier uses an all-natural, non-toxic solution that gets rid of odors, decontaminates surfaces, and scrubs the air to eliminate 99.9% .9 of molds, odors, viruses, and bacteria. We run three Odorox purifiers nightly in the preschool and kindergarten classrooms. In the cafeteria, we use a cleaning wand and microfiber pad and disinfect the tables after every lunch period, allowing proper air drying time after cleaning. We also use a floor scrubber nightly to ensure maximum cleanliness. In the bathrooms, we clean toilets, sinks, and floors nightly. And we use a pump sprayer on the bathroom walls. We spray and wipe door handles nightly. Most of our classrooms have sinks for good old fashioned hand washing but we also have hand sanitizer dispensers in our classrooms, cafeteria, weight room, and other high traffic areas. All of our classrooms have disinfecting wipes and electronic wipes for easy and quick cleaning. Our maintenance team members do the best they can to keep our school germ-free. You can do your part by following these simple rules of respiratory etiquette. Avoid touching the T-zone. This includes your eyes, nose, and mouth. Cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. The inside of your elbow is a great option. Wash your hands. If your children are showing any symptoms of illness, it's best to keep them home so they can get rest and fully recover. For more information, visit our health office webpage. Help us help your child stay healthy and trust that we are doing everything possible to prevent illness within the Belvedere School District.